We're here in the barn with the pickup horses learning about equine dentistry. Just like we need to keep our pearly whites clean, so do these guys. But did you ever consider what kind of job that would be? They might not get cavities like you and I, but horses have dental concerns too. The, the main problem they have is sharp teeth. So from the way they grind their feed, they sharpen the edges outside of the uppers, inside of the lowers. And it's a constant ongoing natural process. And their front teeth, um, that kind of poses a problem as well because the horse was designed to do one thing and that's roam the plains and eat grass. But with most horses living off hay and oats these days, it's a good thing for them to get regular checkups, especially if they're showing signs of discomfort. Things like throwing their head, refusal to pick up leads, going one way better than the other, um, temperament problems. That's when you need to call an equine dentist. A lot of the job is filing their, their sharp edges so that they're smooth, uh, radius, balance is a big thing. Um, it's basically uh, making them eat more efficiently and making them comfortable. But if you're filing down the teeth, how fast are they growing back? Their teeth actually um, only grow in length until they're about five years old. So the average length of one of the horse's cheek teeth is about that long. When you reach into their mouth, you can only feel about that much of the tooth exposed. The rest is reserve crown. So as, as the horse ages, their teeth actually erupt into the mouth, but they get worn down as they chew. So it's almost like using up a pencil throughout their life their teeth are getting shorter. All the more reason to keep them healthy with a regular checkup. For Saddle Up, I'm Sheila Nyquist.